Hi everybody, I'm Victor Brick and welcome to today's Fit Tip, how to not gain weight during the holidays. I'm dressed like this because I've just come from a holiday party. And of course there's a lot of holiday parties this time of year. And the secret is how to maintain your weight and not gain weight during the holiday season. One of the best ways to make sure you're not gaining weight is to weigh yourself daily. You put on pounds one at a time and you want to track them on a daily basis and that way you can see whether you're adding weight and they won't sneak up on you. The problem with weighing, just weighing yourself unfortunately, is that muscle is a lot denser than fat. So if you're replacing, this is five pounds of muscle, this is five pounds of fat. So if you're replacing muscle with fat because you're not working out as much and because you're eating more, you might end up weighing relatively the same amount but being actually fatter. So what you want to do of course is track your fat gain as well. The most accurate way of doing that is percent body fat but that's pretty complicated. The easiest way to track your fat gain is to measure your waist on a daily basis. Just get yourself a tape measure like this and measure your waist because most people put on fat around their midsection first and if you find yourself adding inches then you're adding fat. So if you're tracking your weight daily and you're tracking your waist girth measurement daily, you can see if you're putting on pounds and if you're putting on inches. And if you are, that means you've got to eat less and exercise more. If you enjoyed this Fit Tip, please feel free to pass it on to a friend. And for a text version of this Fit Tip, or for past Fit Tips and Uncle Vic's, please visit our website at www.brickbodies.com. Finally, we close every fit tip with a corny joke for the day. And the corny joke for today is, where do polar bears go to vote? Where do polar bears go to vote? Why, the North Pole, of course. I told you it was corny. Until we meet again, see you at 100 years, that is.